Hi everyone, my name is Fatima and in today's session we are going to, I'm going to cover the tips, some of the main tips and tricks uh, for mirror board that you might be able to use during your ideation session and your virtual uh, team collaboration. So what is Miro? Miro is an um, infinite whiteboard, virtual whiteboard. And it's a free platform that you can uh, have access through creating an account with in Miro.com. And uh, as you might see, it's an infinite space. So you can create um, different boards. Uh, if you see in my screen, uh, sorry, uh, create frames in different uh, size, custom size or any specific size that you might need for your uh, ideation and then I choose a color for my frame and um, there are the other things is that there are lots of pre-built um, uh, and customized templates that you might be able to use for example if you want to use it for developing a persona customer journey map and um, lots of other things so if you click on this you will ha have access to lots of free templates that they have for example research and design you might see that uh, the common uh, templates that many teams use is mind mapping for ideation um, team ideation so when you choose we will add it blank. and then it's somebody yeah anyway and um, the main the main other feature is uh, is sticky notes that um, they have because you can do your ideation in your uh, in any of those frames and write your idea in there and share it and cluster it in your with your team the other feature is that you can upload and share your content in Miro. for example you can uh, copy and pay, uh, drag and drop and copy, I mean, copy and paste any URL or drag and uh, drop any picture that you have in your computer. Or the other good feature is that you can upload any Google Doc. For example, if you have done some research about uh, your project in advance in Google Doc, you can just sh uh, share uh, that Google Doc here and you can edit it without leaving Miro. You can uh, edit that document from here. You can uh, share a, a Google map location. See, so everyone in your team will have access to that if you want. It's a, yeah, you see it's a QT campus. So if you want to share a location, uh, you can just use this link to share that location your mirror board or share a video or the other uh, other feature is that if you if in your team you decide to do your ideation offline for example do some sketching you can um, take a picture from your sketch and just drag and drop it to your uh, mirror board The other features uh, that are really handy are uh, sharing because um, if you see you here, you can share your mirror board uh, here. If you want, you can send an invitation with different access level. For example, if you want someone to be able to edit, someone from your team be able to edit that um, uh, mirror board or if you just want someone to be able to view or uh, come leave a comment you can do that or you can just share this publicly with anyone and give them different uh, level of access and then people visit your uh, use your mirror board they can always leave comment for example great idea and then you'll be able to reply um, to their comments later as well. And uh, mark it as a uh, result issue for comment. In activity session, uh, activity button, 
we can track that who have done what and uh, it's, it's a great feature for for tutors and unit coordinators because they can uh, track that who contributed uh, for uh, for that project uh, completion the other uh, other things is that um, uh, it's uh, Miro is uh, collaborating with other apps. For example, if you decide to uh, find a um, picture, you can just simply search search in Google uh, image and just uh, insert those image to your board. And then you'll be able to uh, to crop those image or resize those image, and yeah, just move it to wherever you want. You can link your the other feature is that you can link your uh, sticky notes together, and those links stay stay there. So if you move these two parts, this link uh, stay and connect those two, two sticky notes to, together. It has, uh, Miro has a great uh, collection of icons as well. For example, if you decide to uh, build a quick prototype, your fidelity prototype in Miro, you'll be able to do that. We will discuss it more later, but yeah, they have a huge selection of range of um, icons as well. As I mentioned, you can, you can upload uh, documents from Different um, different places like uh, Google Drive, you can just simply uh, write text or just copy and paste uh, from other uh, other um, resources. And uh, the other great feature is that if you want to um, put a screenshot from a, a specific website, uh, you can use that. For example, if you can write for I don't know QUT website or um, a, a specific page, just write, um, just copy or write the, uh, that uh, website address and it um, upload a screenshot from that specific page on website. You can, um, the other feature is that you can, uh, sorry, you can, it's already cool, you can group, ungroup, um, yeah, and align. Uh, your image and everything that you have on your board. You can, uh, when, you're, when you are using uh, your mirror board with your team, we can uh, have a chat. And the other uh, great feature that I really like is that when you uh, develop and design different frames in your mirror board, later you'll be able to use them for your final presentation or pitch. So um, uh, you can change the order of your frames from here and then in your presentation mode, you, it's, it's more similar to uh, PowerPoint. You see, I can go back and forth. And you can, uh, yeah, you can present your final project. So let's talk about, uh, um, uh, sharing the final project. In free version for some people, uh, save as a PDF is available, but most of the, when you share uh, your mirror board with someone, for example, your tutor or unit coordinator, they will have access to your board and they will notice when you change someone in your board. Or you just simply can uh, get screenshot uh, with your new board and yeah, share it with them as well. Um, I think I covered most of the features, but yeah, screen, share, uh, screen sharing, yeah. And the other things is that when other people are working at the same time, you will see their uh, mouse and um, uh, what, which activity they are doing on your, on your board as well. So hope uh, this quick tutorial helped you to get an idea about the main features of Miro board. Uh, thank you.